These things, demons have power in our lives in these different ways. But if we, if we don't like being taken advantage of, anyone here like being taken advantage of? If we don't like being lied to and being used and being a pawn, if we don't like that, then we, we actually need to wake up to the reality of spiritual deception of what demons are doing and trying to do in us and through us. That we're actually caught up in a cosmic battle between good and evil. <laughs> it's, it's a, we really have to clue into this, that the temptation for me to hurt myself or to hate myself or to diminish the glory of God in myself, I'm basically being used, I'm a, a tool in this moment, <laughs> different ways to think about that, I'm a tool in this moment to, to actually, I'm being, I'm being manipulated to steal glory from God. And so the, the, the right way to think about freedom is to, and, and to, to, to think about breaking free from demonic power in, in my life is to say, I actually need to embrace the image that God has put in me, the glory that God has put in me, the goodness that He's put in me, the, the beauty that He's put in me, the value that He's put in me. I need to actually embrace that rather than trying to mutilate it and distort it and destroy it and believe those lies about maybe how gross I am or how bad I am or how much I deserve to be punished or how much I should be hated or ignored or rejected or despised or others doing that to me, me doing it to myself or me projecting that on other people, hating others, hurting others. I mean, if we hate and hurt other people, that's just because we hate and hurt ourselves. That's, why, that's the only reason we do that. And so true freedom is, is really waking up to this fact that I'm just being manipulated in this cosmic battle where Satan, the forces of evil are trying to steal glory from God by manipulating and mutilating the beauty that God has put in me and the value that God has put in me. When you like and subscribe, this video reaches more people.